Welcome to wall number three. And so now we start getting into the meat and potatoes of things. This is what people really want to see. How do I have all of my stuff organized? Well, it's organized by kind of thing. So above me, I have this set of wooden shelves that my husband made. Some of the cheapo little organizing things that you can get at one of the big box stores. And then I've got a little rolly cart from Ikea that I love that has all the little doodads that I use all the time. But generally I keep things organized by what it is. Uh, I have a lot of these white shoe boxes you can see up on the shelf. The lighter ones I store on end and then the heavier ones I keep you know, right side up. So I'll have all kinds of things in there. I have one for lace, one for white cording and white thread. Um, I have all my books together down on the bottom. This is where I keep all of my bins with all the projects that I have going on. So if I'm making clothing for myself or some stuffed thing or a particular set of figures or whatever, it's all organized by bin and sad to say sometimes they get piled up and stacked in there. Sometimes I'm working with a whole bunch of fabrics at once and so I will stack those on the shelves behind me. And then this whole area here is silk fabric and cotton quilting fabric. And I used to buy a lot of the cotton quilting fabric because, you know, like many of you, I'm a fabriholic. But generally, I don't use this stuff at all. So I'm trying to use it, make some quilts, and get rid of them and give them away. But the silks, I do use a lot. So this is all stuff that I get at thrift stores that people give me. And this is a small portion of the fabric that I actually use in my artwork. Generally, everything is organized by color. So it doesn't matter to me what kind of silk it is or what kind of garment it is. I'll just stuff it into a cubby. Uh, depending on what color it is. So all the reds, all the blues, all the greens, and sometimes there are multiple cubbies with a particular color. And when I need a particular color, I'll just go in and pull everything out, and sometimes I'll put it on the table, and sometimes I'll just toss it on the floor and just go sorting through and see what it is that I need. Um, over here in the little drawers, I have a drawer that's full of all the sort of hardworking industrial type fabrics, you can think of them that way, um, interfacings, cotton flannel, cotton muslin, um, and then I have a drawer with some tools, some of the larger tools, uh, painting things, papers, stuff like that. Then I have my radio, I've got a clock up there, um, a couple CDs, and then that's it. So this is a portion of the fabric and the tools. All of the fabric, really the majority of the fabric, is in wall number four, which is right over there. So let's head that way. I know you're interested. It's a little scary. <laughs>